hey good day guys you're welcome again to my channel i am joshua the designer and in this tutorial i'll be showing to you how to obtain your results for your foundation beams the moment diagram the shepherd's diagram the beam loads and other it is that you have on your foundation beam All right so um this video is um done following the request we got from one of our followers um on instagram all right um and this is to tell you that i am also on instagram at joshua the designer right this is ayman saying that um he wants to know if it's possible to get moment diagram of foundation beam the same as story beam all right so this is um probably a common situation to people trying to find out if it's possible actually to obtain the moment diagram just as in the case of the story beam all right but now um in the quest to look for the solution for um iman and other people would have this similar situation all right so um i start to find out for my foundation beams to see if we can actually find a way through all right so for story beams um we can actually find that um, on the design tab using story beams just click on story beams then you have all your beams as displayed all right so to check for the diagram in this case you can find diagrams here for selected beam anyways so le let's try to do one or two things with with our beams now all right so this is this beam in particular and you can see the diagrams here so clicking on the diagrams you can actually find diagrams for your moments and your shear force so the first one represents the shear force for the part for this particular beam and the second one represents the moment diagram all right and um, on the left hand side you can find the load cases and combination so these are the results of the analysis all right all right so but now this is for suspended floor you can also adjust the scale here if you feel you need to see um, something more or less you can um, do that all right so that's for suspended floor of course if you filter now you find out that we are on the first pen floor and the roof floor and that's why it is possible for us to do this all right so you can find the deflection also you see the deflection display you can actually tilt that or or select whichever type that you would you'd want to view all right so um that's simple for suspended floor however i would like to answer to hyman concerning moment diagrams for foundation beams all right so if you get um, down to your foundation beams you discover that the diagrams is not activated so um, you probably not find a way to obtain your moment diagram you know your shepherd diagram whatever it is as in the case of the story beam, you may not find it however um if you check an alternative route to find out the values of your moment diagram and knowing full well how some of your um, moment actions to go for example your raft beams now you know the raft moment diagram are somewhat inverted all right so what you may not just need in some cases is just the values that represent how much the the moment you have at the spans and at the supports all right so alternatively i came here design reports each time you come here design reports you find these beam loads print shear force diagrams print moment diagram so let's let's see what we have there okay so at this point um, the report is preparing and um, is basically going to show you values for your moments for your shear force and um, the beam loads also 
but however we don't have the beam moment diagram all right so at this point um, this is supposed to give us a moment diagram at this point but um, unfortunately there's no provision for that for the foundation beams right but you can have your moment at this layer you find this is the position for a moment at the top and a moment at the bottom all right so um, we can just pick up the values and appropriately use them um, knowing full well how the diagrams should be all right so at um, this for the moment bending moment for the shear also you have the, the table for deflection also and the area of steel and um, you go there also for all all these however you would not be able to find the diagram for bending moment and shear force all right but in uh, in case this video is helpful and um, of course you find one or two things around the information you're looking at or you seem to have other questions to ask you may please drop them in the comment section as i'll be there to attend to your queries your comments your uh, questions and all of that i'll be there all right so we'll meet in the next video i'm joshua the designer and in case you've not subscribed to this channel you're my first time viewer uh, you like to subscribe to this channel and like this video share with your friends that should get better in structural engineering till we meet in the next video bye